Hey there. You must be the new guy Emir mentioned. Welcome to the Watch. So, what's your name? And why are you even here? Well... The name's Noah. As for being here, the world's a big place. I want to see as much as I can. <laughs> yup, I'm the same. We're two peas in a pod. I left my village because I heard something big was happening out here in the world. I mean, I didn't know where it was happening, so I just started running. And right as my legs were ready to snap, I ended up here. Name's Leon, by the way. I'm sort of an old hand around this place, so if you've got questions, fire away. You've been here two days. Come on, Mimi, have a girl's back. I'm Gar. No one's been warming this post longer than me, which ain't really saying much. The Watch are basically mercs with public backing, and we get slapped with every kind of job. Some folks stay, some folks leave. Don't know if you're a stayer or a leaver, but we'll see what you can do in the meantime. I am Mio of the East Reach. Welcome. That's easier. So, did I hear right that we're teaming up with the Empire Gar? I can't believe we're gonna be working with a bunch of imps! I know the League and Empire ain't got much in the way of rosy history, but I guess this is some kind of goodwill gesture. All above my pay grade, but I know this much. When a politician shows you something with one hand, it's the other one you gotta keep an eye on. Still, a job's a job. They set up a command post on the hill there at the Elder's residence. You ready for your first assignment? You got this, kiddo. Just keep it loose. It's also your first assignment.
that's the last of the arrangements. Gesture of Amity, my hide. Those prune-faced mules on the council just wanted to saddle me with the grunt work. I'm going to make them pay for it when we get home, mark my words. Will we be returning to Norrister straight away, milady? I thought perhaps we might rest a spell. A few more days of this balmy weather would not go amiss. Additionally, I've heard tell of a local herb chicken dish that simply melts on the tongue. We don't have time for that! Why do they keep pushing me down? Ugh. Well, so be it. If I have to put in double or triple the effort to make them respect me, then that's what I'll do! <sighs> now let's go. Um... You're with the watch, yes? Good, good. As you may be aware, we need leverage to negotiate with the Empire, which means we must pull our weight on this little co-expedition. I don't expect you to find a primal lens, but if you locate the rune barrows, I'll see your paid extra. Jingle jingle and all that, yes? Now get out there and show me some results! Dazzle me, handsome. Uh... Sorry? Janequist! We are leaving! Uh, very good, milady. Oh, and see if we can get that herbed chicken to go. <laughs> well, that was a thing. That was our new boss, Lady Periel, head of House Groom. Her land, her rules. She sure took a shine to old Noah here. Lucky you, making a good first impression. I did what now? Here. Remember, this is a co-expedition with the Empire, which means we'll be paired with Imperial officers. Best behavior, all of you. Especially you, Leanne. Sure thing! The League's operatives will be here soon, sir. I believe everything is in order. Thank you, Hildy. So what do you make of this co-expedition? I welcome the exchange of olive branches, sir. A soldier's greatest wish is to not be working, after all. Just so. Let us hope the olive branches are genuine.
Hmm. Looks like we found our officers. I take it you are the delegation from the League of Nations? Welcome. You come well recommended. I'm Lieutenant Sane Kessling of Galdia's 1st Imperial Army. I'll be leading one team on the co-expedition. Awful young to be a lieutenant, ain't ya? <laughs> you some noble kid? Is it your job to pry into my lineage, good Lycan? Guess not. Noted. I am Hildy, Lieutenant Kessling's aide. The objective of this operation is to locate the rune barrows that were recently discovered in the forest. Uh, sorry, question. Why do we have to find something that's already been discovered? A local stumbled upon the ruins while lost in the forest, and while he provided physical evidence of the find... He got lost again on the way back? Correct. Our search team has been assigned the area north of here, through the forest. Unfortunately, we don't know the lay of the land, hence the joint effort. Don't worry, lady. We'll handle the navigating. I've been preparing two whole days for this. <laughs> yep. <sighs> We're prepared to leave at once. Is this agreeable to you? Makes sense. We'd head in first, so the rest of your team knows where to go. Come on, then. Let's get this show on the road. Are you not with them? Huh? Oh, yeah, I am. Sorry. Um, name's Noah, by the way. Nice to meet you. Likewise. Well, if you're coming, keep up. To review, our objective is to traverse the northern forest and pinpoint the location of the rune barrows. Is that clear? Crystal, ma'am.
what you get! Pretty sure this is the forest we're looking for, Lieutenant. Keep moving. We've no time to waste. Is it just me, or is he kind of a jerk? <sighs> Why can't he be a sweet little angel like our Noah here? Less talk, more walk. Exercise. Training is the friend that never betrays you. things. Uh, I don't know a quick way around, and there's no way we'll move this ourselves. Uh, guess we'll need to back off until we get reinforcements. Step aside, please. Huh? What are you... Was that magic? No. It felt different. The Empire has been studying ways to amplify the power of a rune lens by channeling it through a device called a regule. Oh, that's incredible! I, I wish mine could do that. You've got a lens, Noah? Oh, well, ladies and gentle wolves, so do I! Rub-a-dub-dub! -dub. Don't be a flub! <sighs> there! Did you see the glint? My power is usually focused in my hand, but I can't seem to redirect it as magic. A lens's power conforms to a wielder's talent. Yours is merely doing what you need it to. So everyone here's got a lens? What about you, Hildy? In a manner of speaking. Hmm. Nice. That regular contraption is pretty impressive. Are they common in the Empire? Dunno. More importantly, where are you from, Noah? A small village up in the mountains. <sighs> Were your folks okay with you joining the Watch? Cause uh, mine sure weren't having it. 
My parents are dead, actually. Oh. Sorry. It's all right. The other villagers are like family to me, especially Aunt Martha. And she really didn't want me to go. If you all don't mind, we need to carry on. Without incident. Experience is strength. Two arms. Without incident. Huh. 
Huh. What is this? Some sort of shrine, though the design is unfamiliar. Hmm. Let's do this! We're not alone. Stay alert, and keep moving. There goes my plan to stop for a picnic. Did we... Well, well, well. I smell a mystery afoot, kiddo. You think maybe... Yeah. Could be related. Okay, I really want to know what this is for. Started again? So it seems. Some sort of magic? Okay, I really want to know what this. Enemy sighted! Ready to intercept! Yes! Conflict 
resolved without incident. incident. Without incident. Something's here. Weapons up, everyone. We got company. Where? I can't see it. Up there! Above us! Let's get it done!
apologies. What was that? The forest eater? They caused plenty of trouble around my village, too. Good thing you brought us. We're skilled, and we know what we're talking about. Yes. Um, thank you, Good Lycan. I have a name. It's Gar. As you wish, Master Gar. When you say it, it sounds so sarcastic. Uh, fine. Call me Mio. Okay, hang on. Did we really never do introductions? In that case, I'm Leon. I saw you checking out my moves during the fight. Pretty snazzy, eh? Yes, they were hard to miss. <laughs> yup, sure were. Well, spread the word when you get back to Galdia. I want everyone to know about the butt-kicking Supergirl you met. <laughs> <laughs> I owe you thanks as well, Noah. Huh. Just count yourself lucky we spotted it first. Anyway... Are we ready to move on? The barrels are close. I can feel it. No, you can't. Stop trying to hog the spotlight, new guy. What is... What'd you do, Noah? The mist is clearing. It and the shrines must be linked. A trap designed to protect the barrows. I've read reports of such mechanisms. So can we get through now? Look at that! It must be part of the rune barrows. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. Did we hit pay dirt? Maybe our rune lens has guided us! Let's press on. Exercise. Does this mean I'm promoted? Somebody smiling on you today, Lieutenant. you guys! Pay dirt with a capital P! Yes, but the entrance is closed.
Not a problem. So long as the ruins still hold life. Room barrows and lenses are closely intertwined, although some of the more neglected ruins no longer respond. So, this is the end, right? Mission accomplished and all that? Not until we know if these are the correct barrows. What do you mean? Our true objective is a special caliber of rune lens known as a primal lens. The mere possibility of finding one is why so many resources have been mustered for this operation. Uh, hey, yeah! I, I think the Yelly Lady and Aaronside mentioned something about that. Is this primal lens so different from the ones we have? Indeed. They are priceless. Only a handful have ever been discovered. Well, there's only one way to find out if it's here. Where is your sense of caution? Look, I want to know what's inside. I mean, I bet there's all kinds of wonders I've never beholded. Beheld it? <laughs> Fair enough. Then it's agreed we'll explore inside. Good. Get a look at this place. It seems promising. Over there. What's that? I can't make it out. Is it the primal lens? Pretend it is. What do you get out of this? Fame and fortune? Let's just say it would be a stunning accomplishment. Does anyone see a way to reach it? Well, we came this far. Let's sniff around. Exercise. Ooh, 
It's another one of those gate things. Back up, folks. I'll handle this one. Rub-a-dub-dub. -dub. Open, you schlub! Uh, hey! This one's broken! Open, you dumb door! I think it's more like... Now the new guy is seriously overstepping. Sorry, boss. I can't help it if I'm a natural. <laughs> I love it. Now come on. Are we locked in? Either someone truly wants us here, or they truly do not. Let's do this! Yes! This is it! Nothing to worry about. Exercise. We activated something. This place is amazing. So, what's with the they must mean something. I think the wind changed direction too. Perhaps there are new places to explore. Such a good widow, Noah. Yes, you are. Uh, <laughs> uh, 
Thanks, Leanne. <laughs> Holy crap! The lieutenant laughed! You okay? Did it hurt? You must have imagined it. Come on. you get. What do you think? End of the line? Let's do a sweep. To me. Same. Well, we'll just have to. Huh? Look out! floor caved in. Can you see what's going on up there? We must have fallen a ways, because no one is answering. Yeah, I can barely make out the ceiling. Crazy that I'm not hurt. You okay? I am, surprisingly. But don't ask me how or why, because I remember none of it. Guess we just got lucky. Well, we'd better go find the others. I looked around while you were unconscious. The exit is blocked by rubble. We'll have to wait for the others to come to us. So, um... Sane. Sane Kessling. Right. Sane. 
Gotta say, kinda stings that the pride of the Empire doesn't look a whole lot older than me. The Empire may indeed consider the House of Kessling a source of pride, but I've yet to earn that pride myself. And what of you? How did you end up enlisting? Enlisting? Oh, joining the Watch? Uh, well, once I left home, I felt like I had to... I don't know... do something? Joining the Watch felt like a good start. And what is it you wish to do, then? Good question. Uh, I guess I just want to help people, if I can. My sister Lean calls me a meddler. And as much as I hate to say it, she's not wrong. So I suppose I want to find out what's so wrong with meddling. A meddler who doubts the merits of meddling. <laughs> nah, I shouldn't have told you that. But I'm glad you did. And worry not. I'm certain that faith in your meddlesome nature will see it become your strength, if it hasn't already. A suggestion, though, if I may be so bold. Return home for your sister's sake as much as your own. Uh, what's that supposed to mean? I found myself taken by a premonition upon hearing news of this primal lens. And now, having looked upon it with my own eyes, I am fearful of it all the more. A new age of conflict may be upon us, Noah. The Empire and the League of Nations at war. At war? Kinda out of nowhere, don't you think? We're here working together now, aren't we? We are, but at the machinations of one Dukes Aldrich, a man utterly entranced by these rune lenses. He wishes to acquire them, and has shown himself willing to mobilize his military to do so. That he is capable of convincing other nations to do the same is... ominous. He is a formidable man, and with the Regules he has the means to use the lenses as tools of war. Even the Primal Lens, should he so desire. And few are those who can control their desire in the face of power such as that. Uh, and if you're right, and this war comes to pass, what then? I will do what must be done, as a Kessling must. The misgivings of one man are not reason enough to besmirch the good name of a noble house. Is that so? Well, if the time comes, I guess I'll... What was that? Over there! I see light! Some of the rubble fell away. But why? No idea. And I don't really care so long as it leads to a way out. Noah? I hear it. We've got company. Two arms! This is it! Nothing to worry about. We're on our own until help finds us. We must take caution.
Jane, look out! Let's do this! Zane, look out! Thanks, Noah! That's what you get! Thank you. Also, I see now that you were right. About what? Throwing yourself in front of me like that was meddlesome indeed. <laughs> well, you're still welcome. like a way up. Come on. I bet the others are searching somewhere around here. These comrades of yours must be reliable indeed to worry so. Oh, definitely. I mean, I just met them today, but we're still rock solid. What? <laughs> Never mind. I forgot who I was speaking to. Your aide must be beside herself. Hildy, was it? Oh, I'm sure she's handling it just fine. Either way, I agree we can't stay here. Lead the way, Noah. Say, Noah, I've been thinking. Yeah? We could probably fight more effectively if we timed our attacks better. Why don't I use my rune lens just as you strike the enemy? Worth a try. Sure, let's give it a shot. Ah, and here comes a chance to practice right now. Two arms! Ready, see? 
I got this! Now! By the Rune's power! That's what you get! It worked. Told ya. Did you now? Yep. I mean, it was your idea, so I trusted you knew how to pull it off. <laughs> and bam! I was right! That simple, was it? <laughs> well, if you say so. Right, that should do it. Let's move. Two arms! This is it! That's what you get! Perhaps we should go back for another look. Have you got this? Remember the image that materialized before? It's open. Back where we started. Uh, but the light's different. Look, it's the primal lens. Did it activate? Don't ask me.
So this is it, right? Did we find... Look sharp! No match for it. Run, Sane. I'll hold it off. Don't be a fool. I'm in command here. It should be me who stays. I can't let you do that. You've got a big future ahead of you. As do you. Go, Sane. There's no time. up, boys. Stand your ground. Y yes ma'am! What are you doing here? A little early to be calling a retreat, Lieutenant. The cavalry has arrived. Are you all right, Lieutenant? Hey, kiddo. Hey, a blondie. Which one of you ordered a hero? Because she's here! A hero? Hero win. She hero? Uh, whatever. Form up! We'll show this monster that flesh and blood are more powerful than stone! Ready to teach this thing a lesson, Sane? I'm ready. Thank you. 
apologies. on the battlefield. If you want to survive, be ready to adapt. Damn right. Take what you're thrown and turn it to your advantage. Mercs don't have to play it by the book. Wise words. I'll have to remember that. Take what you're thrown. Maybe we could use the rubble to take cover.
guys. Got this. Something's happening. Yeah, what's that thingy on its head? I think it's targeting us. Another blast like that. Hide behind the rubble. It's the only way. takes care of that. Training is the friend that never betrays you.
Got him. <laughs> you sure it's a he? That was a rune golem. They've been sighted before at other barrows. Mother load, huh? I know folks say rune lenses are condensed magic, but I don't know what this is. Imagine wielding it. No, it's likely too much for one person to contain. There's your mission accomplished, Leanne. We have what we came for. I am so dang happy. I mean, I had my doubts about the League and Empire working together and stuff, but we pulled it off. <laughs> yep. She's right. This victory belongs to all of us. Well said. This discovery is a symbol of newfound friendship between the Empire and the League. Let us remember it always. Then we are agreed. The disputed Norsefarian territory will be ceded to the Empire. In return, the Empire will pay annual compensation to the League Council for a period of ten years. Done! I welcome this graceful solution to another of our long-standing problems. This is truly a joyous day, gentlemen. On behalf of the League and the Monarchy of Norrister, I praise you for your tireless work, Dukes. You have Eucris's thanks as well. How marvelous that peace between us will be sustained. Unless the esteemed General Goldwyn plans to hang up his uniform, I wouldn't dream of quarreling with the Empire. Nor I with you, King Valmoris. We all know the ferocity of Kanani warriors, and I fear I would be outmatched. Hear, hear. Today's meeting has been an excellent demonstration of what we might accomplish together. If I may, Dukes Aldrich. Hmm? Groom's daughter, was it? Periel Groom, Your Grace. Such an honor to meet you. P Periel, you're, uh, you're an adjunct, so you're only here to facilitate. Quite so. And as such, I would like to facilitate a discussion about why, after giving the Galdian Empire the primal lens we found half a year ago, we've received no reports as to how the research is progressing. And perhaps I might also facilitate an explanation as to why they haven't paid their share of the costs. <laughs> I'd heard that Count Groom's heir was sharp as attack and twice as prickly. And I see the rumors are true. My apologies, Miss Groom. The Primal Lens is a rare artifact. Even the Empire has never seen its like. As such, its study is taking longer than we initially anticipated. However, 
You have my assurances that we will respect your contributions and share our findings as soon as possible. I will also ensure you receive payment by the time you depart. I believe you're staying with us a few days longer. Indeed, Your Grace. It's a beautiful city, and I was hoping to explore it. Also, it's Countess Groom, not Miss. Uh, Ariel! No! <laughs> My deepest apologies, dear Countess. I pray you enjoy the rest of your stay in Galdea. Please don't ever do that again, my lady. Oh, I thought my heart might stop. They asked me to facilitate. I facilitated. You demanded, milady, and to Dukes Aldrich, no less. The man whose influence in the Empire surpassed only by the Emperor himself. I'm well aware, Jenquis. I simply don't like the man. What do you mean? The Dukes has gone out of his way to make peace with us. That Norsfaria purchase gives him Fort Atlas, which is the perfect foothold for invading League lands. And he got it for a song, especially when compared to taking it the hard way. Also... Also? I can't stand his smug face. Oh, anyway, enough of that. We're going out tonight. So long as I'm here, I intend to sample Galdia's finest. Very good, milady. I hear tell of a regional speciality where they melt the cheese just so, and... Hey, new guy. Getting used to the watch? Uh, <laughs> I've been at it for half a year. Two days less than you, remember? Ha, what a kidder. Anyway, I'm gonna head over to the mess hall. Not like we got anything better to do these days. Well, she never changes. Ah, Noah. Perfect timing. Gotta talk to you. What is it? As I'm sure you know, the watch has got a pretty high turnover. People come, people go. And they all got their reasons. Heck, even Mimi took off. Went south to you, Chris, on some kind of warrior journey or whatever. That's why I want you to take my place as captain for a while. While I'm not planning to up and vanish anytime soon, I think it'd be good practice. Yeah, it'll be good. Wait, what? You're making Noah the acting captain? I've got seniority by two days. You should have asked me. I did ask you. You said, and I quote, that sounds like a pain in the butt. Mm, yep, that sounds like me, all right. Fine then, Noah, I officially dub thee acting captain. Well, Noah, what you say? Sure, I'll do it. See? Decisive. That's what I like about you. Now, for your first assignment, let's go tell Emir what's going on.
Need something? I'm gonna be letting Noah take over as captain for a while. Ah, you would do that to me. Did it ever occur to you that I might have my own plans for how to allocate our resources? Why it's my job to create order out of this shoddy ragtag outfit is beyond me. I'd quit on the spot if it weren't for her ladyship. Hey, it is what it is. Going forward, Noah chooses our teams. And if you catch wind of any jobs, you set him up. Jobs? Oh, there's no shortage of those. I thought the Watch was created as a reserve force to assist the standing army in times of crisis, but it seems I was mistaken. Because the rest of the land clearly sees us as some kind of glorified errand runners. Ah, oh, why me? Why? Why? Right then. What sort of job would please the Watch's finest? Tiger hunting! Not listed. Wolf hunting! Anything related to hunting, not listed. However, the watch is shorthanded. If you meet anyone gullible enough, <laughs> capable enough, then kindly recruit them. Can I trust you with that, oh great captain? Just Noah is fine. <laughs> Don't let me down, oh mighty captain. If you bring home recruits, I'll consider letting you thicken out your team. In the meantime, I can't spare anyone. You got it! Show him what the watch is made of.
Fair enough. Right? Leave it to me. See you. Oh. <laughs> Some stress relief, perhaps. Do come again whenever.
Huh? You selling something? We're looking for capable people to join the Eltis Vice Watch. Yeah, I've heard that name all right. Got my own mission, though, so... A mission, is it? Cloaks, daggers, that sort of thing? Generally. Well then, how about this? I'll help you with your mission, and in turn, you can help me with mine. You are gonna help me. Buddy, you don't even know what the mission is. Could be I'm out for blood, looking to part innocent heads from quaking shoulders and all that. Mm, you don't seem the type. And that being the case, I don't see the harm in helping. Actually, most folks would say I'm exactly the type. Question is whether you're keener than some or stupider than most. Last chance. Next time I ask you to help, you're gonna be bound to it. If you say it's a vital mission, I trust you. <laughs> you're even nuttier than I thought, and I love it. Know what? I'll join you. My mission can wait. Something tells me I'm in for a wild ride if I stick with you. Lead the way, then.
Oh, yikes! Sorry, I was in a hurry. Hey, you wouldn't happen to know the way to Red Throat Ridge, would you? Supposedly, it's east of here. Help a girl out. Well, um, you've got the direction right. Yes! All right, evildoer, here comes Magical Girl Malore, ready to dole out equal helpings of love and justice. Thanks, mister. I don't know, but I got so caught up in it that I didn't think to stop her. We can't let a little kid wander into Red Throat Ridge alone. Come on! There she is! Um, excuse me, Mr. Soldier? Hmm? What's the matter? Could you tell me which way is east? I'm trying to get to Red Throat Ridge. Oh, well, that's, uh... Got it, thanks! Okay, Malor, back to work. No rest for the righteous. She's on the move again! We'd better hurry!
Yes! I've got him now. He must have thought he was pretty slick holding up in a place like this. But there's no pulling the wool over the eyes of justice. Magical girl Malore sees all. Huh? Who are you? Hey, wait a second. You look kind of shady. Are you bad guys or something? Well, guess what? You're about to see the error of your ways. What? I'm not shady. Nobody disturbs the peace on my watch. By the light of my guiding boon, and in the name of love and justice too, magical girl Malore is coming to get ya! Oh no, you've gotta be... Take no prisoners! Magical cutie missile! Oops, sorry. I thought for sure you were villains. That's what I get for judging a book by its cover. I won't make that mistake again. Do I really look that shady? Yeesh. So, what brings you out here? Oh, well, we ran into you back in Altus Vice. You mentioned Redthroat Ridge and I thought, that's not good. This used to be a bandit stronghold. And there are dangerous creatures on the prowl too. Trust me, I did a job here once. It's no place for a kid. So, you came all the way out here to stop me, even though you don't even know my name? Actually, you've shouted your name like seven times now, so I think I've got that. Okay, well that settles it then. You must be a good person. So, tell me about this group you're in, the Watch. Is it some kind of super justice squad? Sure, let's go with that. So, in other words... What you're suggesting is that we team up and fight evil! Magical Girl Malore meets Noah's Super Squad! It's bold. I like it! What? No, I'm here to talk you out of this. And what evil? There's a real nasty monster holed up in this pass. And I'm not talking the garden variety. It's packing some seriously dangerous magic. If we don't stop it, something awful is bound to happen. And you were planning to face it alone? Hey, I wouldn't be much of a magical girl if I wasn't ready to get knocked down a few times. But I always pick myself right back up. <sighs> All right, you win. We'll help you take down the monster. Your new tag team is here! Let's get this show on the road. Challenge accepted. Bring it on. That's what you get.
the room's guiding light? Magical girl Malora is coming to get ya! Not even worth sullying my blade. I just keep getting better. Challenge accepted. Exercise. my blade. Challenge accepted. Like 
like it. Not even worth sullying my blade. I feel stronger! Are you sure this magic packing super monster is even real? Of course I'm sure. The intel came straight from one of my old comrades in arms. Wait, so it was your idea to investigate this? No one asked you? Well, technically no. But it's a magical girl's duty to smack the bad guys up with love and justice before they become a menace. Seems a little presumptuous. So what? It might be a thankless job, but somebody's got to do it. And hey, who are you to talk about being presumptuous? Uh... Nobody asked you to follow me all the way out here, Mr. Worrywart. But you did, didn't you? And that's why I knew at first glance that you were a good guy. Actually, you called me shady and... Now get a move on, Noah. Love and justice aren't gonna dish themselves out. <laughs> I feel like I'm talking to Lean. By the rune's guiding light? Magical girl Malore is coming to get ya! Like it? Last one! A big day for justice! Stop it! Uh -huh. 
take it. Magical cutie missile! Ah! What? What? Last one! Not even worth sullying my blade. Experience is strength! Challenge accepted. Exercise. I like it. Let's do this!
some serious magic. You think it's our target? Oh, I know it's our target. <laughs> it's go time, Noah. You remember how this works? Don't worry, I learn fast. Any monster that threatens the peace is in for a stomping! By the light of my guiding rune, and by the power of love and justice, magical girl Malor is coming to get ya! Evil doesn't stand a chance against the forces of good. By the light of my guiding rune, warrior of the Watch Noah is coming to get ya! Did I do it right? You did it so dang right! And this is where I bust out my secret weapon! Magical Pretty Grimoires! those two books? They're grimoires, Noah, and they help magical girls like me dole out justice. Okay, but why are there two? Pick the one closest to the monster. It's as simple as that. I don't think it is, though. Oh, come on, Noah. Believe in yourself, and justice will find a way. Huh? Where'd it go? Trust your gut. Pick a book, and let's hope justice is on our side. See how you like this! Go get him! Magical lovely justice hammer! <laughs> Love doesn't have time for bad guys, and that means you! Yeah! Magical cutie missile! Ha! Even me. Yeah. 
careful! We're in bad shape!
see how you like this! Oh, Venom! Magical, lovely Justice Hammer! Listen to the whispers of Justice! What does that even mean? stronger. We did it! Love, Love and, and justice! justice. So, uh, we done here? Yep! Grimoire's deployed, monster destroyed! And now folks out there don't have to worry about a torrent of evil magic wrecking their day. You did good, Noah. Thanks. <laughs> Happy to be of service. So, here's an idea. Why don't we keep this tag team going? Except I'll help you now. It's only fair. Seriously? Yeah. You know... Assuming your super squad at the watch has room for one more. You never know when a magical girl is just what the situation ordered. Well, if you're really sure. Totally! When justice calls, I'm there. So, can I ask you something? Sure, what? What exactly is a magical girl, and how is it different from a mage? Oh my gosh, are you kidding? They're like night and day! A magical girl is like one part love and one part justice, and do you want to write this down?
the rune's guiding light? Magical Girl Malore is You're coming okay? to get ya! Take this! Magical Cutie Missile! <laughs> Done here. Not even worth sullying my blade. This magical girl just powered up. Gar, you old dog. It's been too long. What in blazes are you doing back here, Sabine? Last I heard, you were off quelling some kind of rebellion in Kenan. <laughs> oh, it's quelled. Thought I'd come rest my bones here for a while in the meantime. The watch? Your idea of resting your bones? Maybe. Or maybe I just smell opportunity. So, who's this? One of your men? You got a name? Noah. See here, Noah. When you've been a merc as long as me, all it takes is one look at a man's face to know if he's long for this world. Ain't looking good, kid. Huh? What's that supposed to mean? Sabine. <laughs> ah, forget it. Probably just the ale talking. Good men know life is precious, including their own. You be a good man, Noah. And who is that delightful lady? Sabine's an old friend. Nah, she'd laugh me out of the building for that. Let's call her an old... something. As mercs go, she's long in the tooth. Probably too damn stubborn to die, honestly. Yep, I can definitely see that. Some stress relief, perhaps. <laughs> Some stress relief. Well, 